There are reports that some doctors are choosing not to use ventilators on coronavirus patients. The theory is that the ventilator could hurt the patient depending on what condition they're in. Well, Channel 2's Jeff Preval has been looking into this today and whether it's happening locally. Jeff. Well, I checked in with a couple local health care providers to see if they're moving coronavirus patients off of ventilators. Both ECMC and Kaleida Health say no, but according to the Associated Press, some doctors out there are doing this. Now, this is just one example of how difficult the coronavirus can be to treat and how a lot of information about the virus is not proven. According to the AP, some hospitals have seen higher death rates with COVID-19 patients when a ventilator was used. Here are some numbers between 40 and 50 percent of patients with severe respiratory illnesses die on a ventilator, but at least 80 percent of coronavirus patients in New York City who were on ventilators have died and that there have been similar death rates in other parts of the country. Now, the article explains that there may be a lot of factors at play here, such as the condition of the patient before they were infected or how sick they became, and that some doctors are trying to keep patients off ventilators as long as possible and using other breathing techniques. Again, there is still a lot that is unknown about the coronavirus. This as many states and the federal government are searching for more ventilators. In Buffalo, I'm Jeff Perval, Channel 2 News.